गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज फोर पॉइंट टू इन दिस एक्सरसाइज थ्री साइड्स ऑफ द क्वारिलेटरल विद टू डाइग्नल्स विल बी गिवन ओके सो दीज आर द मेजरमेंट्स ऑफ द फर्स्ट क्वारिलेटरल विच इज एल आई एफ टी हियर थ्री साइड्स एंड टू डाइग्नल्स आर गिवन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स ड्रो द रफ डाइग्राम ओके इट इज़ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू ड्रॉ रफ डाइग्राम सो विदाउट एनी मेजरमेंट यू कैन ड्रॉ अ क्वारिलेटरल this is the rough figure mention that rough figure okay now name this figure as l i f t l i f t and next step is to write the measurements l i l i is 4 cm so mention that this is 4 cm now i f it is 3 cm then t l is 2.5 T L this side it is two point five centimeter and now L F is four point five L F is a diagonal so let's join L F this side is four point five centimeter and next is I T this is four centimeters I T is also a diagonal join this this is four centimeters. Okay, now let's start the actual figure. So uh, it would be better if you start with a diagonal. I'm going to take diagonal L F first of all. L F is four centimeters. You can draw. Uh, you can start drawing with L I also, but I'm taking diagonal firstly. L F. It is four point five. So measure it four point five. This is the line segment of four point five centimeters, and the name of this line segment is LF. Okay, now see on one side of LF there is point T, and on other side of LF there is point I. Okay, now in this side, on this side, sorry, on this side we are having both the measurements. L I is four centimeters, and F I is three centimeters. Means we can easily get this arc. We can easily get this point I uh, by do, drawing the arcs of four centimeter and three centimeters. So firstly, I'm going to find out my point I on one side of L F. From L point, I is four centimeter away. So open your compass. Equals to four centimeter radius. The compass radius should be four centimeters. Measure it using a scale, and then from L point, draw an arc of four centimeter. Okay, I am taking it on the other side of L F. After that, from F point, this is the distance is three centimeters. So measure three centimeters using scale. means your compass radius should be 3 cm now put it on f point and then draw another arc okay now the point where the two arcs are intersecting each other this point is point i okay we have got point i now let's mark point t point t and l The distance between these two points is two point five centimeters. So, take radius two point five. Open your compass. Equals to two point five centimeters. This is two point five centimeter distance on compass. Using L as center, draw an arc. This is two point five. Okay. Now. to get point t we need one more arc which intersect this arc if any other arc will intersect this arc then only will get the other point so that arc cannot be from point f because this distance is not given in the question we are not having this distance but we are having a distance from i point from i to t the distance is 4 cm okay so we'll draw the next arc from point i not from f the ne next arc will be from point i and the radius of the compass should be 4 cm 
measure it using a scale it is 4 cm distance and this uh, this is very important point this arc must be drawn from point i means take i as center put your compass tip on i point and then draw the arc now see these two arcs are not intersecting each other and to intersect them you can extend this arc okay this is how you can make them intersect each other so now as these two arcs are intersecting each other this point is point T let's join them join L and T and then join this T with point F now join Fi and Li so this is the required quadrilateral L I F T okay firstly I've drawn a diagonal after that I've uh, taken these two sides where L I is 4 centimeters and F I is 3 centimeters okay then I draw uh, I've drawn an arc from point L and that arc is 2.5 centimeters and after that the another arc that is not taken this is the dis, uh, difference between exercise 4.1 and exercise 4.2 in exercise 4.1 we are taken arc from this point but here we are taking arc from this point I point okay join this because both the diagonals are given so these must be shown in the figure and the measurement of this diagonal is 4 cm so write down here 4 cm all the measurements must be mentioned so this is the required figure L I F T